What is going on guys? Welcome to your 49th biology video and in this video we're finally going to start talking about mitosis which is one of the two ways that cells divide in your body. Now the entire process of mitosis can be split up into a couple main phases and the first phase is of course called prophase. i draw that a little bit neater. Prophase, there we go right there. Now, prophase has a couple of different characteristics, so let me go ahead and get drawing right here. So here is a cell right here, and the first main attribute of prophase is that the chromosomes are going to condense or pack themselves up into little packages. Now, during interphase, which is of course the portion of the cell cycle where the cell is just going about its daily routine, if you were to take that cell and look at it under a microscope, you couldn't see the DNA because it's so spread out, so loose. However, during prophase, what's going to happen is these chromosomes are going to condense or coil up. And as they coil up into tight little packages, they're going to become visible if you were to look at this under a microscope. Now another thing that happens during prophase is that the nuclear membrane is going to dissolve or in other words, it's going to break down. Now this happens because in order for your cell to divide, it doesn't need your nuclear membrane. So it breaks it down, gets rid of it, or makes it dissolve. Now the last main characteristic of prophase is something called mitotic spindles are going to form. Now think of mitotic spindles as little bugs with arms, and these bugs like to pull on things. So what's going to happen is these mitotic spindles are going to attach to the chromosomes and eventually they're going to start to tug on them or pull them apart. So we'll say that this is the beginning of prophase and at the end your cell is going to look something like this at the end of prophase. So of course we have your chromosomes in the middle which are visible under a microscope and we have your mitotic spindles which are little bugs and they're going to reach out their arms and they're going to attach to the chromosomes. So by the end of prophase, this is basically what we have. So just to recap prophase one last time, it's the first stage or phase of mitosis, and it's when your chromosomes are going to condense or coil up into little packages, and whenever this happens, they become visible under a microscope, and I keep saying they become visible under a microscope, not, not just because it's a fun fact but because whenever you're taking a biology test, your teachers like to ask you that question a lot. So just remember, if they ask you, the stage is prophase. And another thing is the nuclear membrane is going to break down or dissolve because we don't need it for mitosis. And the last main thing I talked about is these mitotic spindles or bugs with arms is they're going to reach out their arms and they're going to attach to the chromosomes. So that is the first stage of mitosis, which is prophase. Now we can move on to the next stage, which is metaphase.